Dear Journal, last time I went to sleep, I, I had a horrible nightmare. Lucas. Hello and welcome back to Pokemon Planum. I'm your host and since we're done with almost everything we could do in the main lesson, all we're going to go and get and do um this area, the only place we haven't visited since I'm going to save the frontier for later streaming. Um, let's go ahead and visit the other areas. To ignore the survival area and then start going to the road, it's too tough for me to travel. Yeah, survival area is really, really, is going to be really tough to handle. So make sure you bring the best Pokemon. Uh, I'll take the Super Rod. Thank you. Anyways, yeah, the survival area is going to be a really tough battle. They... Huh? Uh, I don't know why it stopped recording. I don't know. I, maybe there's, there's nothing wrong. I'll probably skip it if there's no technical difficulty, but yeah. The upcoming route is going to be battle. <coughs> you know, since you know, Actually, let me check out my Pokeballs section. Yeah, we spent a lot of time capturing that freaking... Uh, nah, well, I got plenty of quick balls. Let's go! Route 225. Here we embark our adventure, the master adventure. Where things gonna just get harder as we go by. Tuner's gonna be hard. See, we need cut in order to get through here. And this woman's gonna give us a chance to, um, you wanna double battle there and there. It's, um, actually get. Pokemon that needs to um, need the experience. I see Rob with Claw. Actually, who needs the experience right now? Ah, uh, yeah, let's give you the experience. Okay. Well, you want to fight me? Let's see. We let's see how good this battle is. Yeah, we need cut to get whatever item it is. People Pokemon grow strong. Okay, thanks for the philosophy, man. Oh, bird. Burp! That's gonna be here. Oh, we got a ranger and a burp. Mm, okay. Taylor and Linuna. You guys don't know this how Leone looks before um, the Gil Galliard version came along. So just to let you know, this is what it looks like. Defense! You would attack. I remember, I used Tail before. You evolved it. Um, it has very, it's very speedy and it could actually be very, very strong if you could utilize its ability guts. I've used it before, it served me well. And Farfetch. Yeah, I'm not too scared of Farfetch. That Arbok though, that's the keeper. Um, area is the Arbok. Acid. Oh, I see what you're trying to do. Too bad we're not, it's not Helen. I don't think I'm gonna hell right now. We could area ace and finish the um, Arbok. That'd be really great. Rest coin. Yes, now it's gonna is a two v one right now. Uh, so now Pidgeot. Okay, now I know for certain uh, Vesper Queen is gonna have a hard time. Um, yep, 
There's the hit. Oh, thank you for taking that for me, buddy, pal. And gone. Yeah, that's a lot. You are so muscular. It's made me sigh seeing them. <laughs> yes, it's a battle zone. Welcome to the battle zone. We, I was born or recently flown here. That explains um, the tail of Okay, the um, let's leave Vesper Queen alone for now. Let's go against the sidekick. Well, you're gonna battle with me, that's why I'm gonna send out my Pokemon to battle with you right now! You're a... Okay, now would've been a good time to use, um, Vesper Quinn. Ah, no wait! Actually, Slowpoke is just pure water type. And this is before, um... This is before the move Dry Freeze. Which, if you guys don't know what Dry Freeze does, um, is an ice move that is super effective against water moves, water types. Oh no, it is part psychic type. Okay then. It's slow bro. Let's go ahead and continue on with Actually I'm not sure. I think slow the slowpoke family is more of a special tanker than a physical tanker. Let's see if I am proven wrong, but then again, he is just one level below me, so... You use a ninja. Sure, I'll take, I'll take that. Yeah, in, in hindsight, it, I'm glad I did the double battle with the ranger and the bird trainer instead of against the psychic. Yay! Daisy's been defeated. Don't. Then don't tell me my future. Oh, we could surf. We go this way. Unfortunately, because I don't have any of the HM moves, we're gonna be taking this the long way. Dang it! I think well, there's still one thing to get. Radikin, the original Rodin. Let's see if we could just equip all this. Pokeball, go! Capture this Radicate! Okay then. We got a fighter in our hands. I am so sorry for my dog barking. I don't know why she's like... Barking at random stuff. Maybe just a stray animal that has passed by. Maybe a possum. Maybe a dead rat. No, I, I. Well, besides that, I need to heal. Okay, so now where do I go to? And this is such a maze. Um, this goes through here and goes through there. Why have I go here? We got ourselves an item. Is what's gonna happen and HM HP up. Okay. Going this way. The first title fell for our trap. The trap shows me Benetit! Why would not the quick ball be working? Okay, fine. Let's... Can I use items? But I can still use Pokeballs, right?
dead. Am I just that too strong that all these new Pokemon are just gonna die within one hit? Damn it, Glacial. Why are you so powerful? Yeah, there has to be an item. Like, come on, there gotta be some items. Yeah, they're gonna be full of the uh, trickeries to think that there's gonna be items, and there are items gonna be around here. Oh, there's a rock climbing thing, G. Um, should I face? I think I'll face this trainer. I'm gonna move for f to fight. We patrol to make sure that there's nothing strange going on here. Crazy, we battle. It's a ranger. We got ourselves a Pokemon ranger. Skarmory? And it's a critical hit. Lovely. And now, Dolphin. Okay. Speedy ground type. Huh? Aura Sphere. go to waste. I could jet this fool. Yeah, you can all jump. Clean up the environment. Yay. Give me that revive. Yes, we're gonna use it to revive the Lucario. Ugh. Okay. I'll fight him later. I want to see if this house is up. Rest up. The fresh water. I'm saying no one knows where Pokemon or uh, really? That's all? Just water? Good gosh, and there's another tree that's gonna that block my way to um to an item. Alright, fine. Fight me! When you're missing your battle, I'll tell you where you're missing, and then laugh at you for even trying to face me, you ace. Army Water um. It's just gonna do regular damage. Oh yeah, but it's so high. Let's do extreme speed. Let's see how how much damage I can make you take. Okay, I guess we could uh, quickly kill you off right now. Bada beam, bada boom, another extreme speed. Give me that yummy smoothie with a boba. You're out. Yeah, this place is gonna be good if you wanna train up your Pokemon, especially if you have. Um, Especially if we have some. Uh, if, if you have lucky eggs on you, you know, I should go find more Chansey and <laughs> grind Chansey. Actually, now I have the ability to even just find Chansey and just make sure that it's always just Chansey I find. The Pokemon radar makes it possible. I remember Vibratum, uh, Ground Dragon. I used it once, and that was my black too. It's just that uh, I was like confused, like, okay, so tell me again why people say that this Pokemon is like super good. I'm trying my best to understand, but then again, it's like, oh, yeah, I kind of can. 
uh, I understand where the strength is coming from. I just no, don't think I'm using it to the full potential. We found another trainer. Before that, we got a battle. Let's see if we could capture it this time. Or let's see if you can restrain yourself a bit. What's up? What's up? What's up? Minions out the ball. Get the. All right, now we got something for the Pokedex. Give me a doll that became a Pokemon over a bird from being jumped. A seek at the child that disowned it. <laughs> All right, into the box you go. They're being disowned. Fight me! It's best if you, like, you know, let your Pokemon rest before you just go burf. But no. You're like, okay, I'm gonna just have my Pokemon do get themselves killed. By the way, I don't think in. I don't. I don't think um, ice is super effective against bug. I'm just going from my gut's reaction, which is why I'm using waterfall instead of ice punch. Lantern? You can use your lantern on me. Hmm. Yeah, you know what? I, I Rotom can handle it. He's, it's very diversified. It has the Shadow Ball. So I don't have to worry about um, his Thunderbolt. If you guys don't know, uh, Lantern has an ability to uh, nullify uh, electric attack and use it to power itself up. Okay then, let's get out Torterra. You brought this on yourself, I'm bringing you Big Papa out. Oh. His eyes are you surf this time. Okay. Um. You deserve to die in the most horrific way. I cannot figure out any horrific way for you to die than being shaken to the ground, get buried, and then get sm crunched between two walls of rocks. Ah, almost. Oh, you you pumped them with drugs? Jeez. That's why uh, the Pokemon Company does not let you uh, keep pumping them with drugs or else they're promoting steroids or drug use. At least until like Sword and Shield where according to my friend you could just give them all the drugs they can just for the Eevee thing. I say Eevee and Ivy stuff and I still haven't got a chance to explain that part. Well, while we're catching this Braticane slash probably gonna kill it, I might as well explain it. Um. EV training or effort points value, it's um, how to say it? Okay, say you say like you're working out, right? You wanna um, work out on a particular uh, area of your body or something like. Hold on, give me a second. It widows the constantly growing thing by not on hard thing. It could show apart cinder walls and is the mouse Pokemon. Okay, back to EV training. Okay, so let's say like if you want to go to, the, you want to focus on running fast and all that stuff, what would you do? You would um, focus on running on treadmills, right? What if you want to build more muscle? You want to continue on lifting weights and stuff. FEV is kind of like that where um, you want, if you're going to be focusing on one trait of your stats, HP, attack, defense, uh, special attack, special defense, or speed. 
and you just try to pump up that st stats. Um, it's one of those like hints that you don't really see it, but it's there. Um, one way to increase the your IV of those stats, it, EV of those stats, it's um, either pumping them up with uh, vitamins, which of course I have them, or uh, you find a Pokemon and you just continue beating them. You find a species of Pokemon, you continue beating them over and over again. And they give you points for that. Uh, for every four points, it increases your stats by one. You could only go up to like, um, I remember it's like 264 points or something like that. I know it's around the, two, the 260s. Before these, before the game said, yeah, you know what, that's enough. You cannot raise the stats anymore. Um, and right, all this stuff. And then you could just, you could do this too. You can max out to your stats, and then you'll be left with like four or six more EV, EV points that you can use. So you use that for some random stats or something like that. So there's a maximum you can do. For example. If I were to defeat this Machoke, which is why I'm pausing right now, um, he will give me a total of two attack EV points. So I'll just continue on being up every single Machoke that I can find, and it will provide me with a lot of attack boosts. So, um, if I were going to go to the Battle Frontier and I'm going to use Torterra I will want to have my Torterra to go and beat up a bunch of Machokes if there was a bunch of Machamp that would be great for me because those Machamp gives out three attacks EVs and I'm gonna deal with you Send floats out and all that stuff. Okay. Um, in future generation, they they have ways for you to uh, increase your IV train, your EV train instead of like the way they're doing it in this game, where like, you gotta count how many points you get, and you get and you gotta count until you reach the maximum amount of IV you can afford. The Pokemon can before to have and then there's the proteins things the cat and the drugs which um, according to my, my knowledge gives out 10 points of EV depending on which uh, stats you're going for um, but there's a limit on how many uh, vitamin you can give give to a Pokemon like I believe you're going to give up to, uh, to the maximum 100 per stats I think um Fero, the beak Pokemon it has a stamina to fly all day on this broad wing it fights by using the sharp beak okay so yeah um sword and shield removes that so you could just focus everything on EV to have an easier time using your Eaton Train your EVs. Fudge! There's a berry and I don't have cut. Uh, and not gonna lead me to another my obsession with berries. You see, um, I may have good Pokemon's, but the fact remains that I. Oh, you tricked me, you jerk. Um, I have. I may have good Pokemon's with me, but. The matter of fact is, un uh, unless you're just a casual gamer that goes like, okay, well, I have fun. Look at my team. They're the best ever. Um, their EVs uh, are spread around randomly because we've been finding random Pokemons and all stuff. They probably max out on IV and EVs as well, but yeah, it's not like what I probably want, for example. This Glaceon, I'm pretty sure Glaceon fought a plenty of Pokemon that gives out attack HP while I want him to be more focused on special attack IVs. 
That's where the berries came, came in. Introduced in Emerald, um, where certain berries, we'll call them friendship berries. They will increase the friendship of your Pokemon, but it will lower the hidden stats of, of, of one of them. So uh, let's say uh, tomato berries. They decrease the base the base speed of your Pokemon. Make them friendlier. But but I don't need my whatever Pokemon I'm giving it to have to be speedy. I'm focused want to focus them more on defense. So yeah, those berries will be helped. So they will gain back the IVs, the EVs that they can be using for something else, for something better. And that's where my obsession with the berries are coming from. And I actually been growing them off camera. That's survival area. We lose the bad frontier come here to train. I haven't lost a bad frontier. I just came here, just because I need. Ooh. Not meant to you long ago that I want to better. Okay. No, I do not understand it. Okay, where was I? As I was just saying, um, Evie's berry, the friendship berries, is a great way to um, kind of reset um, your Pokemon's hidden um, stats, well, IV points back to them so you uh, transfer them to s another stats they probably need. Okay, so I already explained I EV train, EV berries. Oh yeah, there's another tree right there. Um, now, as for IV, that's a whole different level. Okay, so, you know how, um, the best way to explain IVs. Um, do you know how you're, like, you yourself are, like, a genetic makeup between your mother and your father? Well, that's kind of what IV is. Is the, is their genes, is their genetic makeup. Um, it determines, um, how well they are in different stats. Uh, between 0 and 31 points, if I got this correct. <sighs> Even after all these years, I'm not too well with how to explain IVs and such. But I'll, I'll try anyways. Um, maybe the mama is good with attacks. Maybe the papa is not good with speed. You breed them together and you can probably have a child that don't... That's Problem, that problem doesn't do well with speed and all the stuff. It, it really depends. So it's basically their genetic makeup. You cannot change this until much, much later in... Um, Gen 7? Yeah, Gen 7. Gen 7 is where you could actually mess up with their IVs. Bottle cap. Ooh, TM42, and that contains the move, Facade. Yeah, it doubles the power if you're inflicted with status damage. That's pretty good. Um, <gasps> Swallow will be good with that. The door is shut, members only is painted. Okay, we cannot go inside there just yet. Okay, um... Unfortunately, we cannot continue here because we're going to need my barrel with us. But hopefully, um, the way I explain I EVs and IVs helps a lot. I'm pretty sure there's a tons of um, Pokemon YouTubers that already tells you how all of these hidden stat works out better than I did. But I, I'm, if you guys are just watching me, uh, I try my best. Let's see. Who should I... Let's, mm, let's knock out uh, Vespi Quinn for now. We'll train you later. Oh, there's something hidden here. The room? House? 
miss this place. Red charge, power, blue or special fag, red or stats from red charge while well, like. Mud slab. Oh, we got some more. Well, obviously, this is to teach your Pokemon some new stuff. Mud slab, pro lap, to probably tail. I would say Apatel, but I, I already have Waterfall. Action Power, or Chuck on Chop, Seed Bomb. There's some, some good moves here. Nah, I'm okay. The living here where no one can reach me while we're claiming got sick and tired of seeing people. When I stop seeing people, I be. <laughs> when we live strange people, Pokemon, that's what I'm saying. Alright. Good for you. But there's an item here. A red chard. Neat. There's something to look forward to if you climb up this rock. Whee! Alright, now let's continue on. Uh, I think I recall there's a very place. Oh! Climb! Climb! Don't let the guy see you! Yes, there's a berry here. You know, I just realized these ten, these three has a plenty of uh, the friendship berries. It's not I'm scared or anything, it's just that I don't have ways to heal myself if I get caught in by a Pokemon battle. Well, Pokemon, I'm okay. Well, actually, I do have ways to heal myself. It's just that... Why is my dog so mean right now? It's just that um, I could easily escape from Pokemon battles. Not so much here. Or trainer battles is what I need to say. Carbos! Ah, that's plenty of item. Plenty of, of drugs around here too. Okay, I was corrected. I cannot escape this battle. This Reddit King doesn't want me to escape. It wants me to die. Can you not kill me? Because I... Because I, um... I'm more HP than you. And now that I destroyed this Raticane, I gained two IV speed. Um, if uh, Glaceon's IV is not maxed out. I need to go and buy more Moon Milk. That's what I need to do. Rocks. Rocks everywhere. Lagging Tail. It's basically an item that slows you down. <sighs> yeah, I, 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 I need to... Um, get a double battle here. I don't want to deal with you guys one by one. Come on. Thank you. Let's deal with you two at a time. They grew with Mother Nature. They're tough. I'm standing. I'm a dragon tamer. Oh, one of you are going to be dead. Two of you are going to be dead. Okay, um, Bijud. And actually, let's do Thunderbolt just in case the Blizzard decide to miss both of you. At least we can take out one. You know, I should just focus on Ice Beam instead of Blizzard. Just a thought. Okay. This it's simple. I spin on Terrier, Thunderbolt is out to. Call it a day.
Okay, she grew to level 59. Okay. How how strong is um Totero? I need to check that out before I put him on the front lines again. Found an item. Yes. Energy bomb. I consider it to be um Whoa, there's a lot of items around here. We got to get those. There's even something down here. I'll do that later. For now let's uh see what we got here. I think we got three around here. Boom boom. Big mushrooms. I think they're just gonna be all mushrooms. Let's see. Boom, boom. PP Max. Down, bum, bum. One more. Tiny mushrooms. Okay, well. Two mushrooms, not too shabby. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna just. Uh, I don't feel like dealing with water. I can see how we could use that to my advantage, but not now. Oh, speaking of repel, don't worry, we will capture those legendary birds later, and even more. Just not now. That's more important stuff. A hard scale! Needle! Got a house here. What is this house you might say? There's something scribbled in this notice. The world traveling mister has visited over 150 countries, but the world remains as big as ever. Hey, Konnichiwa! Glad to meet you. Good tag. I'm the mister. In this language parlance, I will be called a craftsman. Something like said, Nise Pas. Comprendo? So, I smell you. I smell some, something about you. There's no question, you are a lover of Pokemon just like me. This is wonderful. So, this is what I would do. I would part your Pokedex so you can read the description of Pokemon in other languages. Except for Tzili, but not for all Pokemon, however. Only the Pokemon of the country's eye, the Monsieur, have visited. Now, may I see your Pokedex? So, I'll change the setting here. For with this here and done. Now, you may read the description of the Monsieur favorite Pokemon favorites into other languages. How Uba? Hey, Konnichiwa, but join all the rest. Have you a French Finnick? See, see, un Pokemon fish style. I have a kind of trade for my precious Mexican. Oh, these are tragedy, a tragedy, I tell you. One day you'll treat them with the Pokemon I want. The Monsieur knows this because I have traveled the world. Now, I believe in Diamond and Pearl. You could get yourself locked here. Because you need a Pokemon with Surf, and Venom can learn Surf, and that's gonna suck if you don't have a way to Surf back. Ooh. We can go there, or we can go up here. Actually, we want to go up here. Route 227. Oh, Ash. Boom, 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 boom. As much as I would like to battle these guys, um, I feel like I'm on a time limit. Pretty sure I could cut down the timing. I it says I'm being recording for almost an hour, but Barry and Wake. Holy oh, version, Lucas. <clears throat> oh, if it isn't Lucas, it's been a while. 
they grown so tough that you're training out here now. Everyone keeps getting tougher and tougher, and in doing that, they develop closer bonds with their Pokemon. That's my master! There's are words of wisdom! What? Are you still having trouble understanding? I don't... <clears throat> <coughs> I don't for a second ever recall except you as my apprentice. I mean, if it's wrestling move, I can show you all you like, but... Oh, master, be like that! You gotta get me into clubbing the survival area! How do I get involved with this? So anyways, Lucas, you're going to Stark Mountain? Even the wild Pokemon are very, very tough. If your Pokemon aren't well trained, they have a miserable time. And again, that kind of challenge is an exciting prospect. But no matter what, you better be prepared. I got something ready for another tournament. Prepare for well. You know, I think I got a little tougher again. That's why I'm off to the battle frontier so I can make some challenges. Master, wait for me! Ah! You always be that goofy guy. What do we have here? Yes! I need rest! I could continue on my adventure. No, I'm okay. I just need one rest. Thank you. Ooh. Oh no, I don't have a bike. Oh yeah, I got a bike here. Oh! It's Bucky! Howdy y'all. Yo, if it isn't Lucas, out here training right away, aren't you? So since you're training anyway, can you do me a favor? I'd like you to patrol Stark Mountain for me. Uh, sure. I'll pass here, there's a little volcano. It's Stark Mountain. Deep inside... It is a special rock called the Magma Stone. I can't explain it well, but it's really important. It keeps a Pokemon asleep. But lately, I've been hearing rumors about Vandals in Stark Mountain. They say goons in space pseudo. Team Galactic are causing trouble there. Huh? What? With me? I'm on my way to the Pokemon Center because my Pokemon's low on HP. So if you could get up to Stark Mountain, that'll be great. Thanks. Okay. Sure. If only Stark Mountain wasn't full of all this... Oh. I'll accept that. Yeah, there's something in this meteorite. A star piece. Yes, not getting more shards. It's a wheezing! You know, I'll tell you, I'll tell you a funny story. Um, when I was playing Pokemon Fire Red, well, on my own time, not for anything. I just wanted to um, create a team for my fire rate. Because I felt like it. Uh, built a Charmander team. Um, Toasty Neem decided to give um, a, a Poliwag at the time a cruel nickname. But that's not the story here. The story is that I was venturing doors through a Pokemon house and. Give me a second. It grows by feeding on gas released by garbage. The very rare triplet has been found. There's triplets? I wonder how much they go for the black market. But anyways, um, I was gonna say is that, oh, please turn around. What I was gonna say is that, um, I went to the Pokemon Mansion at Cinnabar Arden and I was like just minding my business trying to find the key to Blaine's thing with Jiggy to Blaine's gym and oh my gosh thank you very much for using the grass top against Glaceon okay it would be really good if I had best Bitcoin with me but I don't I have to deal with what I have right now anyways um I went to the Pokemon mansion and then all of a sudden, I found a shiny coffin. A shiny coffin. Like, holy snaps. I found a shiny coffin. But then I was like, okay, I yes, I need to catch it. But if you guys know the story of coffins and wheezings, in fact, um, Vortorp and Electro, they like to go kaboom when you get a chance. So I was like, oh god, do I want to battle it or do I just 
And then I just threw a master ball. That's all I can do. I don't want the freaking shiny coffin to explode and die in front of me. Exactly, I felt like that way too, Ryu. But yeah, I still have the coffin. I think I transfer it to um, my Soul Silver game. Well, that's an easy way to get up here. Not going through the um, grass. I'm not sure if I'm supposed to go this way, but still, I'll go visit this way. A life, ooh, a life orb. That's very good comparative wise. I've seen, I use it myself. I've seen people use it. Even my friend used um, life orbs. Oh, it looks like I'm supposed to go over here anyways. Ugh, so steamy. And I'm wearing a jacket. Hmm, I don't know if, oh. Hey, this is it, Stark Nose. No need to get in deep. It's not. Let's do this. Yeah. yeah, but can that old guy really take over? Can you really replace Master Cyrus? Yeah, I hear you. The Elder Chair is a commander, but he can't replace Master Cyrus. Maybe this is a good time for me to be done with this Tinker Lacta thing. Oh, okay. Okay, I see. They're going on. I'm afraid to say. Um, thank you for joining me, blah blah blah, because I'm not sure if this is good. I think I'm going to make this a two-parter, so if I stop after... So if I stop the video after entering Stark Mountain, then that means that... <laughs> oh my gosh, this is going to be a two-parter. That means I got a lot of stuff that I need to record then. Well, let's see how bad this Stark Mountain can be.